Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to Diesel Brothers Truck Building Simulator. Today, we're going to pick up right where we left off at, back in our shop here. We're going to take some more orders today. Um, maybe take one or two, depends on how long they end up taking us and what all we have to do and whatnot. But uh, let's go ahead, hop into the computer here and see what we got. Okay, game's kind of lagging a little bit today. We got some orders here. We got one. Um, so we need short, buy a, new sh buy a new bed for short cab, Art and Sterling, new roof rack, mount the bed, mount the roof rack. We can confirm that. Let's go ahead and do that. Already have an active order. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So there is our truck right here that we have to work on. But man, that bed is rusted. Holy crap. I actually like that blue on this truck, though. That's actually really, really nice. I feel like this is the paint that we should have done the... Uh, truck in the last video but we need to buy a new bed and a new rack a new bed and a roof rack for art and sterling okay so i'm assuming that's in the computer here part shop i'm gonna buy some parts i don't really need a tutorial for this so i think we'll be all right so we're body bed uh standard Art and, Art and Sterling right there. Gonna buy that. And then I feel like Roof Rack is gonna be under Extras, Roof Rack. I know we're looking for an Art and Sterling short that I remember, so that's that one, but that's not the right one. Short. There it is. Buy that one. Yes. And then get off of the computer here. And I believe our stuff is back here. Not yet. Unmount the hatch and unmount all that. Okay. So let's go ahead and grab our drill here. Ours is right down here. So we'll unmount the hatch, which I believe is this. Unscrew the bed. Yeah. It's lost muffler. No, we don't need to unscrew that. Uh, bumper we might have to. Mount the hatch, which is the tailgate apparently is what they're calling a hatch. Which, I don't like the sound of that, but apparently the tailgate is the hatch. Which I don't understand that at all, but okay. So there's another one for the hatch, or tailgate I should say. Drop our drill, pick it up, uh, put it right there, I guess. So unmount the right, unmount the right, left, rear left light. Okay, where's my drill? There it is. So I'm assuming that's that screw right there. We're gonna have to unscrew the bed anyway, because we're getting a new whole new bed. But I can't really get to the screw, is it? No. No, that's not it. Uh, how do I unscrew the light? Is my question. Is it unmount? Okay, so I guess it just comes out. Oh, okay. It's like, where is it screwed in at? But I guess it just comes out, so that works for us. Even better right there. Oh, shit, that went flying. Hopefully it ain't bad. And unmount the rear bumper. Okay, which we did. Unscrew the bed. Okay. Which I'm pretty sure we've done, but not on both sides. What are you for? Okay, you're right there. Uh, no, you're not the bed. You're over there is what I need. Transfer bed to storage. Okay. Uh, part shop. Management. Transfer. Okay. So we have the bed. And then we'll just throw it in the slot A, uh, storage. Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay, so we have the garage, the bed, and I want to transfer that. Okay, so I figured it out now. You have to go from garage. You have to click the part, go to storage, and hit add part. So that makes sense. So now we go here, and then we add that to that. And then there's our new bed. Awesome. So now we just have to mount it, which it's on there. Now we just have to probably screw it all in and stuff. So we're at the right mouse button to screw all that in is what I'm assuming is supposed to happen. I'm pretty sure I got all of it in properly. Because there's nothing we can really do with that. It just automatically goes on the truck. So I believe it's only just the four screws. Yep, so we'll mount the tailgate back on. Get you off of there. Get you. Awesome. I don't know why they I don't know why they call it a hatch. It's a tailgate, not a hatch, but I guess they think it needs to be called a, a hatch. So if you guys do get confused when I say when they say hatch and I say tailgate, that's what it means. We're gonna close the tailgate. And I believe now it's just the left light. Yeah. So it's one of y'all. Uh no, you're the right one. Okay, there we go. And then let's do this one. Mount that, and I believe we're done. Mount the rear bumper, which is right here. Don't want to forget the bumper, because he'd probably be pissed. Do that. Let's get you screwed in properly. Mount the roof rack. That is right, I forgot about the roof rack. Which should be right here, honestly. There it is. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Gonna mount that bad boy right up there. And mount this bad boy right up there. Sell old bed and PC. Okay. If only we were actually able to paint the, uh, excuse me, my voice just cracked, but I mean, if only we were actually able to paint the bed so it's not like two-tone different colors, I feel like that'd be a lot better. Let's go ahead and go into management. Uh, it's not management, it is part shop, sell. So we're going to sell the bed for $128. Let's do that. Oh, hit the wrong thing, finish the order. Let's go to orders. Oh, uh, finish order. Orders. Confirm order. No. Finish order. E. 37,500. 204 fans change. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So that is done. Customer's happy. I'm going to go put my drill back next to the, uh, here. Uh, I guess that works. Um, but yeah, let's go see if we have any other orders we can play with. Looks like we do, and there's a shit ton of stuff that we could do with this one. So, highway to diesel. Body of the truck has no secrets for you. It's time to get deep in the chassis. This time you'll buy the lift and replace some parts from underneath the car. It'll be done. You'll add some crazy hot rod decals from the decal shop to add a finishing touch. Works for me. Alright, so what do they want done first? Buy a lift and PC. Okay. So, we're going to buy a lift here. Uh, management. No, it's part shop buy lift parts uh, which one are they looking for in PC management upgrades part shop buy we need tires but we need a uh, lift parts but I don't know what lift we need that's the only bad part I know they want tires and stuff, but I don't know what lift parts they want. Ah, here we go. Lift. Okay, because I thought they were talking about a lift kit. So here we go. We're going to buy a lift, which we did. Now we're going to lift the car, which I'm assuming there has to be a button or something here. Um, I don't know how to lift the car. Here we go. There we go. Okay, because I thought they were talking about a whole, like, lift kit for the car. Okay, so we're getting to the underbody here. 
Open map, go to scrapyard. Oh, scrapyard, scrapyard, scrapyard. All right, add front right rotator splash and right front rotator splash and left exhaust catalyst. Vessel left catalyst, yeah, we'll add that. And then that's what we need. Buy the two, $940. Let's head back. Uh, yeah, let's head back to the uh, garage, right? Okay, where are the items at then? Right here. These two? Yeah. I'm going to have to add these to the trailer. I completely forgot to do this part. Probably a good thing it told me to do it. Okay. Open map, go to the garage, right here. Alright, back in the garage here, unscrew and unmount the front right wheel. Alright, let's do that real quick. Gonna unscrew that wheel. So we basically do everything here pretty much, uh, for what I'm noticing. I'm going to do that, unmount that, put you right here for now. Unscrew and unmount front right wheel, which we just did. And put that there. Uh, unscrew and unmount front right wheel support. So we're going to get rid of the support as well. I believe it's just these six screws here. Unscrew brake. Yeah, we don't want to unscrew the brake just yet. There's a support, which I need you right there. Front right brake. So yeah, we are supposed to get rid of the brake. There's my thing. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Oh, that's not for the brake, is it? No, that's a sway bar. Brake goes here. Unscrew and mount front right rotator disc. So we're going down and dirty into this bad boy. Screw sway bar. Not the sway bar, I need the rotator disc. Which is somewhere here. I don't want to unscrew an engine just yet. Not the radiator. Where's... I'm just going to pretend it's that. And take that off. If I can. Front right rotator disc, which is pretty much this thing. There we go. Rotator splash, which is you, I'm pretty sure. Alright, let's take out the rotator splash. There we go. Getting down and dirty into this truck today. Unscrewed them out front right rotator splash, which I just did. Or am I missing a part? Mountain screw. Okay, mountain screw. Okay, so we need our new one, which is on the trailer here. There we go. Mount our new one right there. Drill that bad boy. See, this is actually pretty simple. I mean, it's kind of cool because I kind of, I don't know, recently I've kind of wanted to become a mechanic for some unknown reason. So I feel like this is going to help us out, help me out a lot. 
a rotator disc which is you put you on there right there no yep there we go I don't need to screw anything in here do I no uh, front brake which is this bad boy yeah I don't know recently I've kind of just wanted to become a mechanic for some unknown reason it's just been it's just I don't know it's just a weird like thing that I've kind of wanted to become so I feel like these games do help out a lot so we're just gonna screw that brake back in and the next thing you've got to do is the wheel support which is this thing right here I believe five bolts wheel support yep that is that there we go we don't have to screw that in do it yeah we do I had a feeling we had to it's support so of course it's supposed to get screwed in Adrian no, maybe not or is this what we need that's a splash shield that's that there we go let's pick up the drill there we go okay I was wondering where the screws were I was like there's no screws for this thing but I thought there was so I'm gonna get a lot of nitty-gritty done on this truck today next is the wheel which is you and then we don't have to screw that in eh, I guess we do interesting because I thought that would come f oh wait that's the old part never mind I'm an idiot I was wondering where this part went but that's the old thing so I'm an idiot put the tire back on there we go unscrew and unmount left exhaust catalyst which is this bad boy I don't think it only has one screw nope it's got a couple screws should be a screw back here too I'm assuming oh no that's the muffler you don't want to unscrew that but what about you right here muffler okay I wonder if that's all the screws that we have for it there we go throw you on the ground mount the new one awesome where's my drill somewhere around here there it is mount that bad boy back in buy four new big tires all right so he wants new tires it looks like part shop buy tires do some off-road tires do four of those because I don't know if this is for four or if it's for one okay so it's one I was gonna say that's cheap for four fucking tires they didn't say what kind of tires did it, it just said big tires right four new big tires E4. Unmount for small tires. So it wanted me to put the tire back on, yet now I have to unmount the tires. I'm like, okay. Mount the four big ones. Got two here, two there. Boom. If I had a truck, I'd put some 33s on that bitch. So here's two. Get the third one on. And I'm assuming we're going to be selling our new our parts next. I'm assuming. I'm not 100% certain though. Boom. Lower the car. I mean the truck. Calling it a diesel, yet you're calling it... It's a diesel, brothers, yet you're calling it a car. Like, <laughs> what the fuck?
transfer cars to decal shop okay true management transfer to decals go decal shop place five hot rod decals okay decal shop yes all right, one thing I have noticed about this game, though, is that it barely has any volume to it. So we're going to get some new decals on the right side here. Hot Rod. Uh, no, you can't really see that. Do bright yellow. Scale it a little bit. That looks like absolute crap. Let's not do that one. That looks like absolute shit. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, there we go. Yeah, I guess. And I get it on the edge of the door here, I guess. I guess that works. I'll apply that. Go to the left side. Apply the same thing. Uh, sh hot rod. There we go. I'm gonna apply the same thing here. Tip facing the opposite. There we go. Uh, let's do a different color though. There we go. Oh, nope. I fucked up on that. position right there now let's actually go to the right side one real quick oh I f are you kidding me did that thing really not I'm so confused right now okay so right side we have that decal that one I want yellow positioned right to the end of the door there perfect apply on the left new hot rod there the colors yellow and make as big as the other one right there position it that right here that works put one on the hood uh, I kind of like this one, so we'll throw this one on the hood. We'll make it black. No, you can kind of barely see that shit. Uh, we'll actually make that white. There we go. That looks better. Apply that. Go on the rear. Do this bad boy, because that actually looks really cool. Do that for the thin blue line right there. Uh, scale it. Make it bigger. Position it right there. Apply that shit. And then we'll actually add another one to the back here. Let's see what we got. Diesel power. Let this one be orange. I actually like that right there, so that works. One, two, we got five. Exit to the map. Go back to the garage. All right, so the truck is back here. Here's what it actually really looks like. Um, not the best decaling work, but it actually looks still pretty badass. I love that one on the hood there, and then the tailgate looks kind of cool too. Um, what we got next is finish the order. So that's not too bad. Finish that bad boy. $62,500. $312. We got an achievement. You can't see it on screen, but it says earn $100,000. Just nice. We did finish that order. Um, I'm actually going to go ahead and sell these parts real quick if I can. So we're really not going to get much for it. Get $4 for that. Um, actually, I might keep these tires just because it's 100% quality. But this stuff, I'm just going to sell, make some extra cash. 
I'm not gonna make much, but I might keep these tires just because they're still 100% quality. So we're just gonna move them out, out of the way. Move them right next to these other tires here. But uh, that's going to go ahead and do it for this one, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy. Like I said, I'm really enjoying this game, so I hope you guys are too. Let me know in the comments if you guys are. Uh, let me know in the comments if you guys do want to see some multiplayer of this game and whatnot, because I kind of do want to try it out a little bit. See how it is like for the next, not maybe not the next episode, but maybe like the episode after or so. So yeah, guys, let me know about that in the comments below. Hit that like button if you did enjoy. Hit that subscribe button if you are brand new and you have do enjoy the content. Make sure you follow me on all the social medias, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Jala, join the Discord server, all that fun stuff. Yeah, hey guys, you guys are awesome. Hope you guys have an awesome rest of your week and awesome weekend. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.